I might have to just hold it up. Okay. Oh, the skin looking good. Period. So nice. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Quarantine has been good. <laughs> hey, everybody. Yes. So we are so excited to have you. All right. So let's just jump right into it. Okay. We release some music that's been popping right now. I've been seeing all, you know, like TikToks and stuff. So we need. Good. Oh, it's lit. I'm having fun. Um, we was hold on, let me set this phone up right. Okay. Can you hear me? I can hear you, yes. Okay, boom. <laughs> so um I was supposed to put out um a project, but with everything going on with corona, it kind of changed my rollout. Mm -hmm. So we decided that we still wanted to give away some music. So every Thursday we drop a new song. Um, for 30 days, we dropped two songs already. We got two more songs, mm -hmm. but the fourth song that dropped, it come with like some extra. Oh, yeah, because I said you tweeted miss. out, um, you got something for us, and I'm like, what's good? I seen that too. I was ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's lit! It's so lit. So I can't wait. Next Thursday? No, we got one more, one more Thursday, and okay. then one after that. Okay, all right. So we gotta just patiently wait then. Yes. <laughs> but I'm excited though because like I was listening to the last couple songs that you dropped and it feels like you are taking it back to like when you was freestyling. Like you just kind of taking us back just a little bit. Giving us that vibe. The crazy thing is like um I have probably like 600 unreleased songs. Uh. <laughs> so um it's a matter of like picking through old songs, new songs and seeing what I feel like you know I want to put out at the moment. Okay. Yeah. But so respect they, is kind of like the same vibe is no problem. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you're giving us that, like, vibe. I feel like when you first, first started, not that you really changed, but that, like, real, I'm trying to get it vibe. So, <laughs> yeah. That's all. <laughs> so, I, with all the songs that you have now, are any of the songs, like, newly recorded? Or are these just all the past songs that you had? Um, so, respect was recorded the end of 2019. Mm -hmm. Um, No Love Story was recorded the end of 2019. The next ones that come out, they were all recorded this year. Okay, cool. All right. And I know you just had a baby. How's mommy like? It's different. Um, <laughs> It's like the most amazing, but also the most like craziest thing I've ever done. Really? It's, it's a lot. Like, and it's a lot to explain to people who like don't have children mm -hmm. or um people who like haven't ever experienced like raising a child yeah and I of course live in um Georgia and my family is mainly in Florida so it's a little bit different but I wouldn't ever change it okay all right and you know everybody always want to know your business like what you I'm not even gonna go to that because <laughs> I know you're very private <laughs> Which is a good thing because I feel like that's how you keep your sanity, you know? Girl, Just they don't still go with the BS anyway. <laughs> and is that why you wrote the book, um, Mind Over Matter? Um, I decided to write my book because when I got pregnant, I started to have, like, real bad um, anxiety attacks. Oh. Like, I would be in traffic and my body would start like shaking. Like I felt like something was about to happen. And it started, like when it first happened, I was just like, okay, you tripping. But it started to happen like often, mm -hmm. like daily. So I decided to talk to somebody about it, like a therapist. And um, a lot of people around me were opposed to it. So that made me write the book because I felt like a lot of people probably go through the same thing. And I didn't understand why people didn't want me to see a therapist. Like, and so many people in the black community that feel like mental issues, like mental health isn't something that exists and it does. Yeah, no, we know, for facts, we know it's a bunch of crazy ass people out here, so. Yeah. <laughs> Did you they experience um, <laughs> postpartum too? I think so, like, um, I'm just starting to like get back to myself. Like for a real long time, I was so stuck on like making people happy, whether it be fans or whether it be people around me. 
family members, friends. And right now I'm just focusing on making Tokyo happy. Yeah. What's been the like the most challenging part of actually getting into that mindset of just making you happy and not worried about everybody else? People, like, people have so much to say. Like, you can't do certain stuff with, without people saying, oh, you're a mom, you're not supposed to do this, you're not supposed to do that. But, like, at the end of the day, I'm still Tokyo. Mm -hmm. I'm still me. And, yeah, I have the utmost respect for everyone else around me, but I have to come first. Because if I'm not happy and I'm not healthy, then I can't 100% be there for my son. All right. So, What's the um saying? You came forth from an empty cup, so yes, ma'am. Tokyo come first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and I know your book is it, um available now because it's sold out real quick. Yeah. <laughs> so we um we sold out like super fast. I think the first day we sold maybe twelve thousand copies. Um, but we that's all we was planning to stock. Uh -huh. We wasn't planning on doing over twelve thousand. So after that, uh, we shipped in a whole lot more, and we stocked right now. Okay, good. 12,000, girl. You should have known these people want to know because a lot of people are suffering from these things, and we don't talk about it. So some people like to keep it private, so I'm sure they'll order a book and not talk to nobody. I didn't know. We were shocked. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been getting stories from people saying, you know, anything about the book or, you know, their mental health or anything like that? Um, they just started to go out, um, I think, Monday. Mm -hmm. So people are just starting to get them. Okay. But people are starting to, like, slowly tweet me and tell me how much they like the book and they love it and it's helped them and stuff like that. And in, inside of the book, it's um, journal entries and stuff like that, too. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then it's also like my psychiatrist um information in there, all of the therapists that I work with, like they work with me on the book to they put their inputs in it, to put his input in it. It's a lot of it's a lot of helpful stuff inside of it, not just my my views. Oh, that's dope. And let me ask you, do you still now seek a therapist and stuff? Because I know some people go and then they'll stop going, but they really need to still go. Um, I stopped when I was probably eight months mm -hmm. pregnant. Um, but we still talk on the phone. She's based out of uh, Jacksonville, Florida. Okay. Yeah, so we still talk on the phone from time to time. And um, is your book, is it just the, like, hard copy, or can people get, like, a digital copy of it, too? Right now, it's just a hard copy, simply because Amazon and Google and Apple won't help me write it. Facts, facts. <laughs> okay, facts. I feel you. Hey, look. <laughs> So for now, that's all. <laughs> okay. I'm a hundred percent. All right, now we gotta get back to the music. So what um what do you what kind of vibe are you trying to create now with the new EP? Because I know you said a lot of it, um, you have a lot of songs, like over six hundred songs you haven't put out. What was the vibe that you were trying to create for this this EP? I'm just having fun right now. Mm -hmm. Like I'm doing what Tokyo wanna do. Like everything is me going with the flow. Okay. And where do you think like, the female rap game is right now? I think it's in the best space that it's ever been in. Like for a long time, people just made it like it can only be like one female artist existing at a time. Mm -hmm. And right now, it's a lot of us, and we support each other. Yeah. Do you got any collabs coming? Yeah, I have a whole lot. Um, the only one that I probably would speak on right now, though, um, the last song that we're putting out for. The four the four week thing that we're doing mm -hmm. is the song with two. The rest okay. of them are just me um for now. And then when I put out my project, it's a whole lot more. Okay. And once the row roll, once all this has passed, we get some videos, you know. <laughs> oh, we're doing all that. We got them <laughs> in the can just waiting. Okay. Oh, honey, you guys in the can drop some for us. We wanna see something. <laughs> Tip is gonna cut me out. Uh-uh. Okay, okay. So we gotta get him on the line. That's what you said, basically. We gotta get him so we can You do that, then I'm all for it. <laughs> okay, well we ready. We definitely ready. I'm ready. <laughs> so what, um and before we go, what twenty twenty? I know we're like in a pandemic right now and all that stuff, but what do you feel about twenty twenty like with everything that's going on? You still think it's hope for this year or it's a wrap? I think it's over with. <laughs> I, don't want to, I ain't want to say that. It's a wrap. Just start over. <laughs> unplug the game. <laughs> you know when you have to unplug the game and blow the, the cartridge? Man? Yes. 2020 that. Do that. <laughs> so 2020 open up 
open back up this year at all? You gonna do any shows for us? You like, uh uh-uh. uh. I'm done. I just, I don't know. I think that um, people should take it a lot more serious. Yeah. Um, And I for sure do because I have a son and he's a baby. He can't fight off a respiratory infection. Um, right. I just think about him more than I think about a whole lot of, a whole lot of other stuff. And he come first. So if it makes sense, if, if, if things are in a better space, then for sure I'll go for it. But other than that, right now, we good at the house. I ain't in no rush to be outside. And that's just that on that. Okay, and make sure <laughs> while you're dropping stuff, drop that skincare routine too, because you over there look good. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> well, thank you. And we definitely going to check out that book since it's restocked. And we got to see at the end of this four weeks what you got for us. Okay, we waiting. <laughs> oh, it's lit. Meet me in four weeks. <laughs> okay. That's what's up. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye, y'all. <laughs>